What's up YouTube? This is Joy Neville back with another video. So today's video is low calorie snacks. And all of these snacks I'm going to show you today are around 100 calories. Some are less. So they'll range from 50 calories to 199 calories. Nothing goes into 200 calories. These are all low calorie snacks, 100 calorie area snacks. If you're new to my channel, thanks for watching. Um, like, comment, and subscribe below. Leave me a question. If you have a question, I'll answer it as soon as I get it. Um, thanks for everybody that has subscribed. We're almost at 100 subscribers. I know that's not a lot for some people. For me, 100 people watching me um, means that I'm helping somebody. I'm giving somebody ideas. I'm inspiring somebody. So that's awesome. Really excited about that. So thanks for watching and let's get into the video because we have a lot to go through. Oh, and if you're new to my channel, I've lost 137 pounds so far and I'm still on my journey. And these are just some of the things I've eaten throughout my three and a half year journey. I lost the first 100 pounds in the first year, 30 something in the second year, and a few this year. Um, and these are things I've eaten throughout my journey. And if it's new and I haven't eaten it, I'm going to try it on camera for you guys today and tell you what I think of it. And I'm going to shout out the person that gave me the idea. I think when you watch YouTube and you see new ideas, you should give that person credit. It might not have been their idea. They might have got it somewhere else. But if you got it from them, you should give that person credit. So like I said, a lot of these things I've been eating for years but there is a few of them that I just found out about and that I tried and liked or that I'm going to try right here on camera today for you guys and let you know if I like it. So let's get into the video. I'm going to scoot you guys up a little bit. Just a little bit. Alright, so first thing that I want to try, I've been dying to try this. We're going to do protein bars first. So the, t the tried and true ones that I've already tried, I will tell you guys about. So some of my favorites are Think Thin. I love Think Thin um, protein bars, these kind. All different kinds. I love all of them. I've tried all the flavors. They're all good. They have a chewy texture like a candy bar. They have a good candy bar flavor. And... The ones that are 10 grams of protein or less are all around 100 to 150 calories. So Think Thins are good. I have a ton of those. This is my protein bar stash, you guys. So when I say keep snacks on hand, they will get you through your journey. Keep snacks on hand and keep the ones you like and enjoy. If you taste something don't like it, keep going. Try something new. But these are some of the ones I've tried, so I'm not going to try these ones today. I've tried the kind, the kind bars. They're pretty good. They're just really hard and chewy though. This one's a maple glazed pecan and sea salt. It's pretty good. This one is 190 calories. I've tried the Think Thin Keto. These taste like a chocolate peanut butter pie. I've said this in my other videos. However, you guys, these will have you craving more and more and more, so I'm careful with these. I try not to eat them too often. These are 180 calories. I love, 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 love pure protein bars. I love them. You can get them at Costco, Walmart, Winko, I think has them, um, Albertsons, Safeway. Most of them are between 150 and 190 calories. My favorite is the chocolate peanut butter. I have it in the freezer getting cold right now because I like to eat it frozen. Chocolate peanut butter pure protein, super good. And another favorite of mine, as you guys know, if you've seen my videos, is Fit Crunch. Again, you can get these at Costco, Walgreens, Walmart, Albertsons, Safeway. Chocolate peanut butter, if you see a trend, I love chocolate peanut butter. The Fit Crunch are 190 calories, just like a candy bar. Again, these are ones you gotta be careful with. If I don't have a lot of calories in there and I just want something sweet, I tend to lead towards fiber one bars or protein one bars. So fiber one, if you don't know, they have little brownies, you microwave them, they taste like an ooey gooey brownie. They're not bad for 70 calories. If you don't have a lot of points for Weight Watcher people or calories, 
Fiber One's the way to go. Low calorie, low points. Also, the Protein One, or I think it's called Protein One. This is the mint chocolate cookie. These are 90 calories, 10 grams of protein. They're not my favorite, but they're good. They're good if I want a low calorie treat and I don't have a lot of calories left because I count calories. So these are good for that, 90 calories. And the Fiber One, 70 calories. Those are good. Also, these Fiber One, 70 calorie chocolate chunk. These are really good too. They're a little bar. So these are all lower calorie grab and go snacks. Throw me your gym bag, your purse, your glove box. I've said that a ton of times. I'm gonna move these out of the way. These are my little selection. Also these, Justin's peanut butters are good if you like peanut butter. Squeeze it in your mouth at the gym. You got some protein. This one's the honey one. This is 200 calories. So this is the only thing in my haul that will hit 200 calories. Okay, let's get into, so excited. <laughs> I wanna try this first because I've been waiting. So, my friend Erica on MyFitnessPal, MyFitnessPal is an app that I use, and my friend Erica told me about these. She got it from her friend on MyFitnessPal. His name is Dustin, and so, Sorry guys, I, I'm taking notes to let people know that I do acknowledge they gave me these ideas. So Erica, thank you for giving me Dustin's information. Dustin, thank you for sharing these ideas on my fitness pal. I'm gonna try it right now. This is, she knows I like low calorie bars. I don't like to go over 200. These are 170 calories. They're the new hero. So I've had all the Quest ones. Again, I've been doing this for three and a half years. The Quest are good and they're good macros if you're someone that counts your macros, but they're chewy. These new Quest Heroes I heard have a way better texture and flavor. So I'm gonna try them and find out. I got these ones at Target. You get four bars in here and I paid $6.89 I believe for four bars, it's a little bit pricey, but again, these are treats, they're treats, and if you rotate around, these things will last me a few months, literally. So let's try these, I'm trying not to, I'm trying to go quickly and not have a super long video, but that never happens. All right, one gram of sugar, 17 grams of protein, wow. Three grams net carbs, that's really good, I love low carb, and 10 grams of fiber, which is excellent. 170 calories. Oh, now I heard if you put some peanut butter on this, it's really good. I have not eaten today, so I will be adding this stuff in my fitness pal somehow. I'm only taking bites of certain things. Mm. Let's put a little bit of peanut butter on it. Just a little. Probably should have shook that up. Okay, peanut butter on. Try this. Oh my god. You guys look. Do you see the chew and the stretch? What is that? It's like blueberry filling. Oh my god. Okay. I'm gonna try one more bite. I wiped off the peanut butter spot. One more bite without the peanut butter. I might have a new favorite. Mmm. Mmm, you guys. These are good. I'm gonna eat this later. I'm going to log it too. I'm going to log it. Thank you, Erica. Thank you, Dustin. Mm -hmm. That's going to be one of my new favorites that I buy every month for a while. I'm going to tell you that right now.
try these, you guys. Try them. The texture is bomb. The filling, whatever that filling is, is so good. And don't get the muffin. Remember, get the hero and it's cobbler. Blueberry cobbler. The hero makes the difference. Those bars are the difference. That is so good. And I'm not someone that likes that white chocolate outside, but it doesn't taste like the other ones. And there's no protein taste. Those are really good. Okay, now we're gonna try, I should have opened these ahead because I have nails on. Now we're gonna try the Hero again, Quest Hero. This one's a chocolate peanut butter. Again, the macros, 19 grams of protein, three grams net carbs, five grams fiber, one gram of sugar. These are exactly 200. So when I said everything was under 200, so I've had two things right at 200. But still, the other one that was really good, that was only 170. That's super good. And it's huge. I don't know if you guys, let me show you the link. Well, here, I'll show you on this one. This is my hand. It's exactly as big as my whole hand. And I'm going from the wrist to my fingernails. Look how big that is. These are huge and they're super big around too. This is a good quality protein bar. I love chocolate peanut butter, but that right there, that blueberry cobbler is amazing, especially with a little bit of peanut butter on it, but it was good both ways. Okay. I'm sold. I'm sold. Get rid of all the other bars. Oh my god. Mmm. These are so good. Where did they come from and how did I not know about them? Thank you guys. Erica, Dustin, thank you. You guys, Hero, Quest Hero Bars is where it's at. Not the regular Quest. Quest Hero. I think those are my favorite new bars. Now I don't even want to try these. Oh, these are the salted caramel. I have already tried these. I just got them to show you guys. These are the Think Thin Salted Caramel. They're 150 calories. They're really good too. They're chewy candy bar texture and they taste exactly what they describe as. They don't taste protein-y. I've already tried them for a couple years. But these Hero ones, you guys, I think outdo these. Wow. Thank you guys for that. Man, those are good. I want to eat them when I'm done. I can only eat one because I can't have all those calories in one day. So I'm going to have to save one in the fridge for tomorrow. So good. So good. Erica, girl, thank you. Dustin, yes. All right, on to the next. You guys have seen me talk about these, so I'm not going to go too much into detail. But the light and fit Greek yogurts are where it's at. Everybody's been using them on um, Weight Watchers and um, health journeys and everything. These are where it's at. They're really good. Strawberry cheesecake, 80 calories, low carb, low fat, yada, yada, yada. Yum. Staple, I've been using these for three and a half years. I love them. Put that to the side. Pickles, been using them for three and a half years. You want a snack that you don't really have to count the calories or count very low calories? Munch on some pickles, whatever your favorite brand is. Okay. Fruit, you guys know. Nectarines, peaches, apples, bananas, grapes, eat fruit and vegetables. Those are so low calorie, you can't go wrong, they fill you up. Nuts, you guys know, I eat a lot of nuts. These are pistachios, I got them at Costco in a big box. They're 130 calories for a pack. Any kind of nut that you like is good to have in the little travel size packs so you don't overeat them. I don't know why I keep standing up like you guys can't see me. <laughs> I'm excited. That bar was so good. I love caffeine. I hate having calories in my, my caffeine, my coffee. So these little rocket chocolates, you get a treat. It's a candy. It tastes like chocolate. It's yummy. They have different flavors. They have 45 calories. Some of them have 70 calories. Depends on the brand you get. They have two cups of coffee equivalent in this little piece of candy. So you get candy. You don't have to sit there and drink all your coffee and you're good to go with your caffeine. So I use these on a daily. They're called Rocket Chocolates or Turbo Truffles. You can buy them at any little convenience store for like 50 cents. Or you can go to your 
online Amazon or whatever and order a big box of them. Everybody knows about Smart Sweets. I've been using these for years. I love them. They are 80 calories for this whole bag. It's almost full. Zero fat. Um, carbs. It has 36 carbs, but it has uh, 28 grams of fiber. So really, 28, 28, 31, 2, 3, 4, 5. You're getting 8 grams of carbs. Amazing. For 80 calories, you can have Sour Patch Kids, Swedish Fish, Gummy Bears. Yeah. Check these out. You get them online or a health food store. And now, I believe Walmart is selling them, I believe, or Winco, one of the two. And Fred Meyers, I think. I always say have gum. If you get hungry, put gum in your mouth and chew it. Something with our minds, chewing, is like a stress reliever and it cures the hunger craving. And drink water. Always drink water. Sorry if I'm talking fast, guys. I have a lot to go through and I don't want to have a super long video. Jello, five calorie jello. This is always a good snack. Top it with some fat free Cool Whip or whipped cream, and there you go. You can eat two of them even, three of them. Have a snack. You guys see this in every video. Rice cakes. White cheddar is banging. Everything bagel, just tried it, pretty good. Chocolate is my go-to. You can put cream cheese, peanut butter, PB Fit, PB2, jelly. I mean, whatever you're craving, do it. Do it. It mimics a bagel. It mimics toast. I put over easy eggs on them and everything bagel seasoning and cream cheese. Oh my God. They're really good. And the person that taught me about those three and a half years ago were called the Colettes. They're on YouTube. Nicole Colette. Her and her husband have lost like 300 pounds together. Something like that. I've been watching them for years. They actually motivated me to lose weight, you guys. So go check them out. Nicole Colette. She shows all kinds of good... Um, low fat snacks and stuff. If you're watching, hey girl, probably not watching because I'm only a little YouTuber, but hey. <laughs> All right, pitas, good snacks to have. Put anything in them, roll them up, eat them. These are Joseph's pitas, they're 60 calories for a whole one. They're as big as my head. Another one that um, I want to shout out that I've seen, she doesn't know me, I don't know her, but I seen this on her channel. They're new, I wanted to try them. My husband loves them, and he's not even on a journey or a lifestyle. Quest caramel, salted caramel protein drinks. Everybody drinks the Premier. These are banging, way better than the Premier. I know I'm gonna sound shocked to say that. I've showed those on my channel. I've been drinking those for years. Quest ones are better, and they're cheaper, and they have the same macros. The person that showed me those, her name is Amanda Lewis, and she's on YouTube. Hey girl, if you're watching, again, doubt you are, but hey, if anybody knows Amanda Lewis, that's where you need to go watch. She's on her weight loss journey too. She's a Weight Watchers one. She also peeped me on when I watched her channel, these 100 calorie um, English muffins. I'm very low carb and so I pick my carbs wisely and so bread is not in my diet. I found these out, they fit in my macros, they fit in my carb count. I can have these. 100 calories guys for an English muffin with some egg and some spray butter, you got a good breakfast. Thank you Amanda Lewis. And do, 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 do. let me see, oh. And the last thing that I saw on her channel, Amanda Lewis's channel, are these Yasso bars. You guys, the salted caramel is not overly sweet, but it's good. It's not bad. And the salted caramel is 100 calories. I got these at Target, but I've seen them other places too. So just check your freezer section of the ice cream. They're called Yasso bars. You can have ice cream for 100 calories and they're good. My favorite though, I taste I was like, oh, they're good. I'll, I'll have them again. I'll switch them in and out for my rice cakes, my chocolate rice cakes that I do for dessert. But then I tried these. These are banging. Oh my God, are they good. They are fudge brownie Greek yogurt bars by Yasso. 100 calories, five grams of protein. They have live active cultures. These taste like I'm cheating for 100 calories. 
And if I want to leave out both my rice cakes with the cream cheese, the jam, the whipped cream, and the Lily's chocolate chips, I can have two of these if I don't eat those. So I can swap desserts. Thank you, Amanda Lewis. These are amazing. These Yasso bars are good. Another one was these. These are good too, girl. I'm peeping them. I've been doing this three and a half years, and I never looked in the dessert area besides Halo Top ice cream, which I love. But I've never looked in the dessert area. So if any of you guys have desserts you've tried that are 100 calories or less, I'm here for it. These are good too. Johnny's Pops. They're just, they're strawberries, water, and a little bit of sugar. And these are lower calorie, 90 calories for one. But those Yasso chocolate bars, oh my God. I'm going to have one tonight after dinner. As long as I don't eat both of those Quest bars. Because <laughs> i got to fit all that in my macros. All right, moving on, moving on. I'm getting there. A couple more things I want to show that are in shout out so I don't forget. The Laughing Cow. My girl, Olivia Frida Curbs on YouTube showed these Laughing Cow cheeses on some little chopped up cucumber circles. And they looked so freaking good. And they're so low calorie, 30 calories for a wedge. You can have a couple of these, make a big old plate of the cucumbers, put it on there. I'm about to try it. I haven't tried it yet, but these are good. And I'm going to try her little concoction. So Olivia Frida Curbs. She does like weight loss for Weight Watchers. She does try on hauls. I love her. She's beautiful. Hey, Olivia. And then there's one other thing. I'm just trying to give people their credit because I don't want to get a new idea and not show the love. Um, D and G's journey on YouTube. They're again a weight loss channel. They do Weight Watchers. Um, I don't do Weight Watchers, you guys, but I watch every weight loss channel you can think of. I love them. That's how I lost weight. Again, the Colette's um, Obese to Beast. You guys probably all know him. They influenced me to get on my journey. I've lost 137 pounds, so why not give credit where it's due? There's room for everybody. I'm not one of those people. So, D&G's Journey, they did these on one of their videos where they were trying snacks. I think they were out driving and she bought this and tried it and loved it. They are the Jack Lynx 50 calorie packs. 50 calories. 50 calories for this. It's bigger than my hand. Bam. 50 calories. And you guys, I feel it and it's full. It's pretty full. 50 calories for beef jerky and she said it's really good so I'm excited yum I'm not gonna try it now because I just ate those quest bars and I know I'm about to go ham on them but I know it's good because I've tried some of her stuff and it's all good these I've been doing the Jack's cheese links and they're also from the Jack's brand and these are I think it's 90 cal yeah 90 calories for both a good snack to have <coughs> And then the last person I have to give credit to because I don't want to steal someone's idea and not give credit, even though I know people do it all day and it's not a big deal, I just have to give credit. That's just who I am. The Veggie Straws by Sophia Marie D. Sophia Marie D is another weight loss person. Again, I think she's on WW. I can't find anybody that is doing like portions or low calorie other than obese to beast. Um, he kind of counted his macros, calories, portion control, and then the Colette's, they count their portion control calories type of thing. So other than that, everybody's on Weight Watchers that I watch, which is fine. I just convert it to my calories, and it's still the same type of stuff. She, Marie, Sophia Marie D showed these ranch flavored. Now, I've known about these for years. I've ate them for years on and off. My husband even likes them, but they're ranch flavored. This is a pack with cheddar, ranch, and regular. But she said the ranch flavored is bomb. So I'm going to let my husband eat it so I'm not worried about opening it. I just want to give it a try so I can tell you guys if it's good or not. Oh my God. Mm-hmm. Okay. Mmm. Zesty Ranch. She ate these on her channel. They are good. She ain't lying. They taste exactly like the flavor, not the texture, but the flavor of the Cool Ranch Doritos. 
Mm-hmm. If you like the Cool Ranch Doritos flavor, you'll love these. I feel like I'm being naughty when I'm eating this stuff. That's crazy. I think I've showed you guys everything. No, I haven't. I've been eating these for years on and off, but I just wanted to show you guys because I went and bought more. I haven't had them in a few months, and they came out with a new flavor that I've never seen. And you guys know I love everything that's everything bagel flavored. I even use the seasoning, the onion, the garlic, the poppy seed, the sesame seed. I sprinkle it on my rice cakes and cream cheese all the time. These are poppin'. Everything bagel popcorn mini cakes, skinny pop. The reason I like these, the flavor is mild, but it's there, it's good. I also got the cheddar. You guys, you can have, where is it? 20 cakes for 120 calories. You can have 20, I just spilled protein bars. You can have 20 of these for 120 calories. When I tell you, when I pour a bowl of these and it is full, a, a regular size glass cereal bowl, and it's heaping full, I'm not lying. These are like that big, like a huge 50 cent piece or bigger. They're not like cracker size and they're filling. But I don't eat them plain. I like a little bit more flavor. So what I do is I dip them in like tuna salad or chicken salad and it's like my little boat to my mouth. So that's how I eat these. But they're really good to snack on at night with a movie or anything. So go check them out. I got all of this stuff was in one haul at Target. All of it. So Target has all of this for sure. If you go there, you'll find any of it at Target. But I do know Walmart sells some of it. Albertsons, Walgreens sell some of it. So if you don't have a Target, especially for these Quest bars, the Quest Hero, I was told Walgreens had them. But Target also has them. Walmart did not have these. I went there. I was on a mission, you guys. I was on a mission. These are so good. I can't right now. Okay. We're done. Love you guys. These are all snacks that you can eat and lose weight. With anything you do, just look at the back of the serving size. And if the serving says one serving is one bag, which all this stuff is one pack is one serving. Have one serving. If you know that it's only 100 calories and you have 200 calories left for the night because you count calories or points or whatever, have two. Just try to stay under your, you know, your calories or your points if you're doing Weight Watchers. To me, it's all the same. Points, calories, calories in, calories out is how I look at it. And portion, portion your portions. If you don't count calories and you at least portion and go by the back of the serving, you'll lose weight. Anyways, love to everybody. Thank you to the people that I watch on a daily basis that I'm subscribed to that give me ideas of new snacks because I've been doing this three and a half years. I get tired of some of the snacks that I eat, so it's nice to see new ideas come to the table. It's nice to see people try them and tell you if they like them. All of these snacks were good. If you try them, you can't go wrong. These are good in my opinion, really good, because I've been doing this three and a half years and some stuff is not that good. These are good. Anyways, like, comment, and subscribe if you like this video. And I'll see you guys on the next one. Love yourselves. Be positive. Thank others. Appreciate others. Support each other. It's a crazy world out there right now. We need love. Have a good day, guys. Catch you on the next one. I'm short. <laughs>